Okay. This is a black widow spider in the corner of my shop. And uh, I was just vacuuming my shop and I noticed in this corner there were some dead bugs here. And I've seen these this spider web uh, is typical of a black widow. They have a very strong web. And you can see there's a cricket. Lots and lots of crickets that uh, she has killed. And she's guarding her nest. And you can see the nest is um, the little brown thing like right here. Okay. And she is under here like that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pull her out. And we're going to check her out here. Man, I'm telling you. This web is strong. She's had, she's killed plenty of crickets for sure. She don't want to let go of this. Uh, so what I'm gonna do is try to grab her leg. Mm. Well, I pulled her leg off. Man, her lit, her web is strong. Okay, so what I'm gonna do? She's still alive, but uh, I was trying to pull her out of there, but her legs came off. This is a dangerous spider. Okay. She's not dead. She's just playing dead. But um, now, what we got here? I'm hoping you can see her fangs. You can. Um, now this is her underside right here, and she has a classic glass shape I'm telling you this web is super strong okay now you can see how swollen she is from all the eggs in her. Now this is looking at her from the side. And I'm going to roll her over. And hopefully you can see the hourglass. She has a perfect hourglass shape on her body there. Now that's on her belly. Also, this one has another little red spot beyond, more towards her tail, right there. But anyway, I was wanting you to just see this so you'd know the characteristics of a black widow. If you ever get bitten by one, <coughs> you'd know what they, you'd know what it looks like. This one, if she had all her legs and I didn't just pull them off, she'd be about an inch and a half long. She is uh, shiny, glossy. This one is full of eggs, so she's very round shaped. But uh, they're not necessarily all this, this round shaped whenever. In other words, I've seen other ones that's not nearly this big. 
but uh, here in the south, they pretty well, all the female black widow spiders have these markings on her abdomen, and um, they're in the sh they're some type of hourglass type shape. Now, what do you do if you're bitten by one of these? Okay. Symptoms can range from mild to severe. Um, if you're starting to have some of the more severe symptoms, such as muscle rigidity, um, abdominal pain, you need to hightail it to the emergency room and let them monitor you. Uh, there's some IV treatment they can give you. They can give you a uh, antivenom. Um, there's also some calcium IV they can give to help with the symptoms. And then you'll probably need some pain medication because of the severe pain that these uh, cause at the injection site. But uh, basically, once you once you get bit by one of these. The first thing you'll notice is pain at the injection site. And I've read where sometimes there won't be any pain. So you can see how it varies from one person to the other. But if you witness being bitten by one of these, just be very cautious. If you start, the patients mostly start having pain at the injection site, and then this progresses up or down the arm, and then you can start having abdominal pain, muscle spasticity as well as cramps, um, nausea, vomiting. Uh, this, this spider here injects a neurotoxin. So it's, it, the, it does not inject a, a toxin that causes uh, necrosis of your skin. That's the, blood, that's the brown recluse. Uh, the brown recluse is what's called a fiddleback spider. She has a fiddle shape to, on her back and she's brown but um, anyway it wouldn't be a bad idea if you're bitten by a black widow to go ahead and start heading to the emergency room um, and then once you get there you'd be able to tell your physician tell the physician how your symptoms are and basically he, you will be treated on your symptoms and uh, for the most part, these spiders don't kill anyone unless they are um, very young or very elderly or the person has a lot of medical problems. So, if you're not treated with the antitoxin, you, from what I've read, you can expect the symptoms to last for several days. So, this is the female black widow spider and she has a red hourglass shape on her abdomen. She's also very glossy. And she has long wiry legs and I'm sorry I pulled those the other legs off so you could get a better view of her but there's only way I could get her out. So that's what a black widow look like, looks like, and I hope this video helps you. Remember, if you're bitten by one, the best advice is to head towards the emergency room. No, you don't have to be in a panic or a huge hurry. Just head towards the emergency room and explain your symptoms to, your, to the physician when you get there, and then basically your treatment will be based on how you're responding to the, to the neurotoxin. I hope this video helps and thank you.